Oh, it's good, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to your Orchard Basement here. And today, you join me on a gear review. This is off the CRK Team Bottle Opener, Paracord Bottle Opener. Now, what this is, is just a piece of metal, steel, I presume, that is shaped as a bottle opener to fit on a Paracord bracelet. Now, before we go into it, I'm just going to do a size comparison for you. This is a standard British two pound coin uh, we have a a euro two cent coin there Let's see what other coins I've got in here that might be able to show it a bit better here we have a stand a new British pound um, here we have a Canadian dollar so you can see the British two pound coin is wider and taller than it but it's not as big as the British one pot coin so you can see there so that's just a little tester for you to see the size comparison and for all you American fellows if I can find one in here I have a well I did for the Canadians and there's a Canadian dollar here that's like a 10 pence coin if you're British. Anyway, let's get into the video. So this paracord bracelet is designed for a King Cobra stitch like so. You can tell it's King Cobra because it's got two double stitches like so. Like that. A normal Cobra will just have one. I'm not trying this on any other paracord type braids but it fits well on the Cobra, King Cobra. Now, how this works is this is a, by the way, a friendly Swede paracord bracelet, and this is very good quality. Now, uh, 550. So, you take the buckle bit here, and you insert it into it, and you it can slide all the way, and you want to put it where for your preference, if I put it in the middle. Now, I have a bottle of beer here, which is a cause light. So, there's numerous ways you can open this. You can take it off and hook it on and open it like so. Or you can do what I do. You put it on your wrist like so. It's easy to put it on like this. And that's how you... So, it's on the wrist. Now, if it was like this, you had it on, you want to open it here, I would... You could try it like that but that's really hard what I do is I roll the bracelet around so the opener is on my on the underside of my arm and the buckle is on the top I'm going to zoom out here for a bit I take my beer and I take my arm I put my arm I'm going to try and do this better way I put my arm on the beer wait it's easy it shows it better this way I'm on the beer bottle and I that's secured on and then I lift my arm to the side now that was pretty bad of me there we are now unfortunately with this what will happen is over time the metal part here will eventually fold in because they are quite thin which is a shame so you might want to straighten them out sometimes um, other than that, it's an effective bottle opener. Opens up the beer, like so. Mm. Refreshing. Now, when you order this, it just comes like that. All you get for your six pounds, I believe it cost me, is this. Maybe be a bit more now on Heine Hayes, just because American products now are more expensive. Due to the fact that we have left the EU, people think, oh no, let's not invest um, in the UK as much. So, American products are going up. For example, the CR, no, sorry, I could say the Spyderco Delica was around £66, £60 on Heine Haynes. Now it is £100. Quite £40 difference there, £40 jump. And that's expensive. And so it. 
is or the budget model is tenacious has gone up from 40 to 60 so yeah so i don't know what the price is now but when i bought this last year when everything was good because we were in the eu um that sent me back six pounds this is a handy little gadget in case you don't like carry around a big bottle opener or one on your belt or something or your keys you can have this on your bracelet and it'll be fine unfortunately the color the black color it's been painted with well it has waded away on the back i'm not sure what the circle there does but you do have crk team printed on the front and a bottle there and the color is going the patina so it has the model number on the back nine seven oh two and yeah this is a handy bit of kit unfortunately i have had some rust uh form in the inside bit there maybe from leftover beer that's gone in or maybe because i've worn this outside in the elements when it's been raining how it's been constructed is the the metal has been folded and i'm trying to find the side on this side here i'm not sure you'll be able to see that but um it's been welded in let me just get a torch you can try and see that better what i'm trying to show you i'm trying to it's light outside so my torch might not show this much Yeah, you can see it there. That line. So it's been welded together. Uh, and that's quite a stable... Well, it, it's solid. Now, I can't bend it easily or squish it. So that shows it's made of a good quality steel. Because it's hard. And it's not going to break on you while it's doing it. Now, I've used this a lot and I've not experienced any faults, any um, cracks or snaps of any kind. So this is a generally good product. Hmm. Not a lager fan, many a bitter fan, but that's quite nice. Anyway, um, would I recommend this to you? Yes, if you want an, an EDC uh, bottle opener, or you just like something to have on your paracord bracelet, or you're into CRKT products, whatever. But all I can say is, this is a great product to have. You can open your beer, which is your main, your main priority in life, have beer. And everything is fine. Um, I just want to let uh, you guys know something. Um, next week, my knife video will be coming out earlier than Thursday because I've got plans Thursday, Wednesday. So it will be coming out maybe Monday, Tuesday. Um, this today, this is coming out on Saturday. So yeah, um, if you're new to the channel. My videos always come out on a Thursday, even that's a review, testing, or unboxing of knife-related issues. Un unboxing sometimes happen differently, but gear reviews come out whenever they can. So thank you guys for watching this video, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a big thumbs up, and you can be more extreme than that, subscribe to my channel. Uh, that would be much appreciated, helps my channel grow, and hopefully you will, you know, you'll see more of my content you will like, and you will... Keep watching, which is the main priority here, to make sure you enjoy my videos. Um, so yeah, I've been the Yorkshire Blazeman, and I shall see you next time.